Hello everybody, uh, in this video I'm going to talk about linear regression using orange. So what is linear regression? Okay, in machine learning, if your target values are continuous, this is called linear regression. But, or regression, when, but you when you have discrete uh, values in your target, that's called classification, which we're going to talk about it later. So let's start with linear regression. It's like fitting a line uh, through a data set. Let's start. So for this, uh, let's just open the file widget. As always, we want to open a file widget and take our file out. For this one, I'm going to use the housing data set, which you can download through my GitHub if you... I think I'm going to use house train data set. Yep. There you go. And just reload, just in case, if it wasn't loaded. Now, the next thing I'm going to do, I'm going to just look at it in a data table to see how, you know, does this data set looks okay we have different features so the number uh, I think zero is the size of the house one is number of bedrooms and two is the age of the house while three is just the price so our target here is three okay now the next thing we're gonna do I'm gonna select some columns because you, you want to make sure that which columns are like you know uh, which column is your target and which columns you want to fit through right so select there you go now let's go inside okay you see by default it already did that so i filtered feature one out what is feature one let's see it again so feature one was basically nothing just number like you know just counting the rows so we don't need that in our but zero one two are our features while target variable is three which is our price good to go okay so if you want imagine if it wasn't like that they were all here what you would do you would just say okay number three is my target value and feature one I wanted to filter it out then reset just to show it again feature one three good to go now next thing I want to do is I want to see this one in a data table again for example see if the columns were correct good to go you see it has number three is a target and zero one two is our features right the feature values now the next thing that we're gonna do is we're gonna do a linear regression right away on this table okay linear regression okay so as you see it says selected data comes here no we want to make sure all the data comes here so again you can double click on this connection lines and say okay I want a whole data to get here right okay now as you see we fed into let's check the results of this linear regression in the data table it should be some coefficients right we have intercept coefficient for the feature zero coefficient for feature one coefficient for feature two okay now i want to see how the how, how it did it work uh, you know is the prediction good or not let's just move these things a bit higher so we'll have more space now let's open another file here And here I'm going to open the test data set. You see, house test. You can find this. I made these data sets and they're available through my GitHub if you want to follow along. Um, again, let's select columns. You want to always do that because you don't want to have, uh, you know, you want to make sure what is your target value, right? So this is already, when you do it once on a data set, if the data set is similar, Orange is going to do it for you. So that's a good thing about Orange. Now, I always, you know, addicted to see these things in the data table. So if you don't want to do that, even in my programming. So as you see, we have feature 0, 1, 2, 3 again. So I had to choose features correctly. Now, I'm going to use some, some uh, widget called predictions, right? And I'm going to connect my data here. So as you see... It's just a data set. There's nothing here. Uh, just the data set I connected. No predictions. But as soon as, let's close this. As soon as I close this, as soon as I connect these also to the linear regression predictions here, you will see some predictions. Let's see. So how good it is. We will go through a better way of ch checking your accuracy. But this is just uh, the you know a beginning for that. Uh, you see the house one was. $415,000, we have 
which is bad, right? It's not that good. I'm going to show you a better ways of doing that. Couple of houses are very close, doing good. Yeah, not bad, you see? So, this is a normal reg linear regression over here. Let's close this thing. So again, we start with the training data set, train our linear regression, and then we have a test data set, and we predict, see how our prediction works based on the model we trained. Um, 